loves welcome or welcome back to my channel if you are new here my name is faith and today guys i'll be reacting to gabriel english jazz for the very first time and he'll be doing black siri and guys i'm super excited as always if you're yet to subscribe to this channel please consider subscribing give this video a massive thumbs up comment share and all that good stuff and Without much ado, let's see what Gabriel has for us in this video. So I got some tweets about the first show. Uh, people were asking Martin because, you know, people saw Stand Up Revolution season one and they noticed that your hair is different. Your hair is actually three inches longer than it was last year. You know, what? I'm just glad I picked up inches somewhere, bro. <laughs> I'll take it. <laughs> Well, it's different, bro, because last year, you know, it was getting longer, kind of starts getting, now you're bringing back the 80s, bro. Oh, I wish I could bring back the 80s. I went hard in the 80s, bro. You know, you know, that, you know that show, uh, Remember the 80s? Mm -hmm. I'm glad they made it, because I forgot half the crap that I did. And you guys have no idea. This man right here, okay, he, if he looks like a rock star, it's because he is. He parties hard. I know how hard he parties. Ozo knows how hard he parties. Let me tell you a story. Um... <laughs> After, you know, uh, season one, Stand Up Revolution, we went on tour for a while. We went all over the U.S. And uh, as a gift to all my buddies that were on the tour with me, I gave everybody an iPhone 4S. Uh, yeah, for gift. <laughs> Martin was so excited because it had this feature, it still has this feature called Siri, where you hit the button and you can talk to the phone and it'll help you out. Like you say, oh, call John. And it's like, you know, ding, ding, calling John. You know, it's really... <laughs> It's really, really cool, but Martin, you see how he is? You know, he messes with the phone. He's like, ding, ding, Siri, tell me something dirty. <laughs> and the phone takes everything literal, so it's like, ding, would you like me to locate a car wash? <laughs> you know? <laughs> so anyways, you guys, I had a lot of fun watching him play with the phone, but then a couple weeks go by, and uh, we're doing a show out in Northern California in San Jose, and uh, we had a really good time that night doing the show, and the, the people invited us to hang out, and we had a bunch of drinks, and... Uh, uh, someone said, you want to go eat? And I was like, yeah. And someone said, you want to go drink? And so Martine and I parted ways for about an hour. And then we met up an hour later back at the, you know, at the hotel. And I'm walking in okay. And he's gone. He is just, Ugh. and somebody's helping him in. I'm like, who are you? I don't know, but he fell. You know, and <laughs> dragging him in. And he doesn't even take off his clothes. He gets into the bed with everything on, including his shoes. So the next morning, you guys, <laughs> Martine comes over to my side of the room. And he's like, bro. Are you okay? Bro, I peed on myself. <laughs> and my response was actually, again? <laughs> because he's partied that hard in the past. Martin has partied so hard, you guys, that there's been times where he's had to throw away mattresses. <laughs> All right? So I go, Martin, why are you taking this so much worse? In the past, whenever that happened, he laughed about, oh, bro, look what happened. <laughs> Party like a rock star, you know? <laughs> he goes, bro, you don't understand. My phone was in my pocket. <laughs> I go, no! <laughs> yeah! I drowned Siri! <laughs> I had a heart attack! And I felt bad because Martin was like, bro, it's a new phone. I go, listen, Martin. I says, hey, don't worry, I got you covered, man. And so I said, listen, I'm gonna go get you a new phone. So we take a nice little trip to the mall and we found an Apple store. And we get to the front and there's a girl there with a clipboard and they're always trying to, how can I help you? And uh, well, we want to see about replacing my friend's phone. Did he lose it? I go, no, it's actually, it, it got damaged. <laughs> well, what's wrong with the phone? I go, it, it kind of got wet. And then she looks at Martin, oh, did someone drop it in the sink? <laughs> like, no, not exactly. <laughs> and she's like, oh, he dropped it in the toilet? <laughs> he wishes. <laughs> <laughs> she goes, well, we have a few in stock. Would you like a black iPhone or would you like a white iPhone? I said, well, you know, Martine and I have the same color iPhone. I said, we both have a white one. So I says, um, just so we don't have the confusion of always grabbing each other's phones, I said, Martine, would you mind getting a black iPhone? He goes, yeah, but um, does the black iPhone have Siri? And I'm like, what kind of a question is that? Why wouldn't the black iPhone have Siri, right? And then I started thinking, can you imagine if a black iPhone was really... A black iPhone? <laughs> you know, Martin gets in the car. Doom, doom. Siri, what's the temperature outside? Why don't you stick your head out the window? <laughs> doom, doom. 
Siri, talk dirty to me. You better not pee on me. <laughs> okay, I ain't like that white iPhone. Wow, you guys, that was so funny. This is the first time I'm ever reacting to Gabriel Ingeshas, and I can say that this guy is so, so funny. He picked the simplest thing and he made a lot of jokes out of it. Oh my God, this was so, so good. And I enjoyed every bit of it. If you guys totally enjoyed watching, give this video a massive thumbs up, comment, share, and all that good stuff. And this is me officially signing out. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.